From Crema Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. Pharmaceuticals and medical diagnostics technology company Roche has unveiled its new compact molecular diagnostic system, which is geared towards improving access to medical diagnostics capabilities across Africa and elsewhere around the world. Darren Parker tells us more. Roche unveiled its new compact molecular diagnostic system, the Cobus 5800, on May 31 in Johannesburg. The Cobus 5800 is the newest addition to the Roche molecular work area, which already features the larger Cobus 6800 and Cobus 8800 models. These bigger models were designed to be installed in large-scale centralized laboratories to facilitate high throughput. The Cobus 5800, however, is a much more compact and less capital-intensive embodiment of the same molecular diagnostics technological capability. So when we really uh, launched our Cobus 8800 and 6800, this was targeted at the high throughput large lag segment. And this is really to address the urgent need around some of the disease burdens that Africa's had. Uh, what Roche has subsequently done is we've brought in now the Cobus 5800, and the 5800 starts to address now the medium to small laboratory setting. This is quite unique and, and special to us because what happens now is we're able to bring a product um, closer to patients out there. Whereas before, if you looked at how the systems would work, patient samples would have to be taken at central points, consolidated and sent off to the large labs to be run. With the Cobus 5800 now, it can be brought closer and the sample and consolidation and testing can happen in a, a setting outside of a, a, a main area in focus. The Cobus 5800 will enable smaller, localized laboratories to diagnose a variety of medical conditions quickly and without having to send samples away to a central laboratory every time. The Cobus 5800 is aimed at improving access to molecular diagnostics in areas where sending samples for testing might be expensive and complicated, resulting in delays and backlogs. It will also reduce the significant expenditure on the transport and storage of samples to be tested, while ensuring that patients can be diagnosed and treated more swiftly. So as Africa has been evolving and the healthcare has been evolving, so has the needs in the laboratories and patients as well. Um, one of the things that Roche is very focused on is to see how we can bring our innovative products into the continent to strengthen the healthcare systems um, and really uh, improve the outcomes of patients. Roche and the company itself is focused on advancing science and the launch of the Cobus 5800 is one of our, our ways of bringing this product and technology into the African setting for the types of laboratories that they have themselves uh, within the countries. Um, and it, it's quite exciting for us now to be able to put these down and increase um, the access uh, abilities or, or potential uh, in the different markets. The compact, fully automated molecular diagnostic system will help address the high demands on laboratories for swift diagnoses, which has increased significantly since the outbreak of COVID-19. The greater efficiency, optimized workflows and cost savings will result in better enabling local medical services to deliver quality patient care timelessly. The Cobus 5800 can deliver up to 528 results in 24 hours, while offering a broad menu of more than 25 different assays, with up to 15 assays on board at all times. It is capable of processing up to 6 assays in a single run, while samples and assays can be prioritized as needed. The Cobus 5800 takes care around the molecular work area, in particular disease area um, testing itself. Um, to give you some practical examples, for example, we know the continent has a high burden of HIV. Um, this is something that can be consolidated and run on our Cobus 5800. It can also address TB itself. Um, if we think about the pandemic that we've just been through now that we moved into endemic phase, um, the uh, Cobus 5800 can run the SARS-CoV-2 PCR tests. Um, so this really helps us to adapt and respond a lot quicker to, to disease burdens itself. Um, and this is among some of the other tests it does. It also takes care of hepatitis. Um, we can also do human papillomavirus testing. And as we know, human, uh, human papillomavirus is one of the leading causes of cervical cancer in women. And this is really going to help us to address women health needs on the continent as well. The assay menu includes options for donor screening, infectious diseases, sexual health, transplant health, respiratory diseases, and antimicrobial stewardship. As much as 90% of routine testing can be consolidated on the Cobus 5800, which allows for in vitro diagnostics and laboratory developed tests to be run simultaneously using the Cobus Omni Utility Channel feature. 
The COBUS 5800 can be integrated into existing information technology infrastructure and is fully automated to limit hands-on time and improve staff productivity. This will also reduce the incidence of manual errors and increase the predictability of results while generating laboratory-specific insights to drive efficiency and productivity. The device also includes pre-analytical automation for greater simplicity of the entire workflow. That's Crema Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy. And don't forget to listen to the audio version of our Engineering News daily email newsletter.